Cheese Puff Hero. Hey guys, this is Cheese Puff back in the city by committee, and I look around. What do I see? Dead people, dead people everywhere. The reason that we didn't have an episode from uh, Exterminator is because he's out of town and therefore is sadly unable to complete his part, so we just skipped him uh, for this week and we're moving on. Uh, I'm trying here to fix the problem of the dead bodies piling up in the streets and I, uh, I hope I'm doing it effectively. Uh, let's try to fix another problem, shall we? Because that's what I like to do. Now, look at this. People are crossing and getting in front of the, uh, the road and that's causing a massive traffic jam all the way back to there. Are they doing it over here too? Yes, yes they are. Now, if they had another option, they would not cross the road. So, I'm just going to go ahead and give them that option that they so crave. And now they can stop walking in front of traffic. I'm going to do the, uh, the same over here, because it's also a very large problem in this section. It's ugly, but it will help with traffic, and I guess that's really uh, what matters. Gosh, they're just doing it everywhere. Whatever, this is the main one. I mean, people are just being dicks. Look, they're just crossing like that, being a dick. Look at all the people on this walkway, by the way. It's, it's insane. Look at them. It's effective, apparently. What other problems do we have here? There are, um... God, more dead people? Really? They're everywhere, apparently. Can... Is there, like, a bug? Or am I legitimately not allowing them to pick the dead people up fast enough. How's the land value anyway? I meant to make the land value super high in here and yeah it's not even super high. It needs more uh, just stupid amounts of parks everywhere. Parks like you wouldn't believe. What are these people complaining about? Not enough goods to sell. I don't quite know how to fix that. I'm sorry if my voice sounds kinda bad. I uh, feel a little bit under the weather today. But uh, the show, as they say, must go on. Oh man, land values are just bad everywhere. Maybe we need some kind of huge mega monument that'll just make everybody happy. Goddamn fire. A building has burned down. I get it. We put down like one of these. I don't know. This seems to make people happy. If I can fit it anywhere in this convoluted district. Maybe. Possibly. Like, these roads are all curved and facing different directions. Oh, I saw some green. There it is. That's gonna make some smiles. You're damn right. Look at that. Then I'll just uh, mop a few more parts in a seemingly random location and orientation. Over here and there and everywhere. And then people will stop crying about having bad land value. Perfect. And uh, that's all factories, so they don't care. No, we need to zone. Look at this. Oh, sorry, look at this. We need to zone. And uh, to zone, we need to put down stuff. Gosh, this is so annoying to do when the roads are curved, and not to mention the fact that the grass is green and that the zoning is green, so it's hard to tell where you've actually zoned. I think I'm getting it, though. This seems to be working. Hey, all these are, um, turned off. What do you mean, turned off? Where's the... Is there something producing a lot of... Mother of God! What is that? What the... Sorry guys, it seems there was a crash. This game just does not like me today, and it looks like it crashed after I built that, but just before I uh, put down some more residential over here. Is this low density? It is. Why are we keeping low density? I'm pretty sure it's in the rules to upgrade from uh, upgrade the density of somebody else's stuff, so I'm just going to pause the game, dezone, and rezone high density residential that will help with our need
and looks like the demand has started leveling off and actually moving towards commercial. So maybe zones commercial. Why not? How about just a strip of it here ish? I'm just doing this all under the assumption that these areas are already connected by water and sewer and everything. I hope they are. What is it looking at? Oh yeah, I think it was this giant dam. There's a massive dam. Eight nine hundred and well, no wonder the power level's so high. That's insane. Look at that. Now, uh, back to business. What needs to be fixed? Well, that's a damn good question, isn't it? Why are all these buildings abandoned? Not enough workers? Residential demand isn't up or anything. Whatever. Traffic? Doesn't look too bad. Train situation's looking okay. This train situation is looking okay. Except for the fact that there are just crap loads of abandoned buildings everywhere. I guess I could try to put roads in this in a way that makes sense. Uh, even though the district itself is kind of convoluted. I might even be able to buy some sort of act of God implement some sort of grid system. I'll try that. Like a 1.5 unit grid. And it seems that it's doing okay. I haven't run into any major roadblocks at this point. But you never know what is going to go wrong. Hey, look! A grid, I guess. And, um... Let's put things in here. Why not? Residential on the strip. Why isn't this zoned? This is like prime real estate. This should all be zoned residential. I should try to make more commercial over there. Because that's always in demand. I don't know what you were going for here, man. But I am filling these gaps with zoning. So um, hopefully that's going to be okay. Look at these unzoned gaps everywhere. Not to mention the fact that like they're connected with pedestrian walkways to the rest of the city that I don't understand. But I don't have to understand it. I'm not the one that made it. That looks good to me. Looks good to you. Did I miss a spot? No. They all want power and water. Oh, there's no water coverage over here. I have come to the rescue. My tubes will carry the liquid nourishment that these citizens need. And like to bathe in and stuff. I mean, it's not all for nourishment. Why can't you just build closer to one another? Why do I have to run these damn cables? There you go. Be happy. I mean, you could have just built here, right off the bat, which is still residential. Kind of want to fix that. Nice. Now we have this awesome commercial district. How's the main? Is this like sep? Oh, I can oh, now I can see. So downtown is here. This is the chestnut district, I guess, and this is the crappy part of town. Hey, nobody's named this one, so I'm going to name it. You know what? Default name seems kind of nice, right? No? Yes? Garnet Heights? Whatever. We'll see if the name actually matches the uh, quality of the district. And I'll make sure to put down a park or two so that these people don't constantly complain about how terrible their land values are. Maybe if I put the parks in just the right spot I can get some power. Yes, no need for cables. That's like the most ghetto way to get power to a location. Hey, and this doesn't have a district around it either, and I built this. So, I'm going to name it after myself. After I zone it, or uh, district it, that is. Nice, perfect. And I'm going to name this area... Cheese Puff Plaza. Ta-da! And I should probably do a policy about something. Why not free public transport because that'll help with the traffic problem over here and is there something else cool that I can do maybe maybe hopefully big business benefactor high density commercial buildings double their, double their sales I'm gonna put that in because that'll be helpful oh oh I've unlocked the airport I can't just not place that 
Yes, I am so lucky. I've been the one that unlocked the airport. Okay, let's do this. I'm going to uh, start off by converting this three-way into a four-way intersection, and I'm going to try to put the airport like here-ish or something. <laughs> Excellent. Now uh, the intersection menu. What do we got from the base game? We've got this. It's kind of large. Should be effective though. Need to get rid of that and that. It needs so much room to place itself down. That looks perfect. Put that there. Excellent. Now to replace the highway sections. Maybe use a little curve to make it look better. That did not help at all. <laughs> Still looks like trash. Okay. Anyway. Back to business. Airport. How am I going to do this? I'll figure it out. It should go, it should fit here. I'm just going to curve this road kind of around like that. So it'll just be a one way and then you can kind of go around in a circle and then come back. That'll help uh, with the flow of traffic to the airport. Okay, it looks like I have managed to get a, uh, a perfect place to put the airport. Wow, look at that fit. That is a tight fit, but beautiful. That looks like it is dead center to me, and plop! Wow, that's awesome. Effective looking, stylish, needs water, of course, they all need, they always need water, don't they? It should have power, right? Yeah, it gets power from uh, here, which gets it from like everywhere else. Definitely gonna put some metro and bus stops and all kinds of awesome stuff on the way right next to the airport. That way people can just get out and, uh, you know, be satisfied with it. Put that through there. Make it come out of the other end. A little subtle curve. Perfect. I'm going to connect this via metro to there and it'll just go, it'll throw a loop, do one of those, and come back. That should be perfect. Now, buses, it should have a bus, you know, stop right there, too. There's water. Like you're not running out, right? It just isn't getting to them. And the best thing to do when the water isn't getting to them, even though there's more than enough, it's just more, just more water, because if you, the way I think of it is, if you put more water in the pipes, it'll increase the pressure and it'll go farther, well, that's not exactly how it works, because this is a video game, but that's a good way to think of it, is anybody using it yet, come on, somebody needs to, ooh, a plane, what's it doing, look at all the people, that's awesome. Maybe if I built a little pedestrian walkway to walk around from the side of the airport to the other side, people might uh, want to use that. Oh. Derp. Okay. There we go. And people will hopefully use it. They are already flowing through. What a beautiful time to be alive. We now have an airport in the city by committee. I could put down like some sort of awesome building that attracts a lot of tourists right next to the airport. That'd be really useful. I might actually just do that right now. Put down the museum of... Oh, it goes like sideways like that. Okay, maybe... Do any of you fit? This fits. This will attract tons of people. I'm going to put that there. Yes, this is going to attract tourists that are going to come in through the airport. Uh, should I put a connection here? Probably. There we go. Maybe one more awesome tourist attraction building and then pack it up. i put this here. I want to put down the Museum of Modern Art, but it just doesn't want to happen for some reason. 
just know where I want to put it. It can be placed. I guess I could put it over there. Okay. Mm, put down this uh, big fancy theater of wonders. I'm going to put that little bastard right there. And then I'm going to zone this. Or district it, rather. And call it something. Committee International Airport. That is literally the maximum amount amount of characters allowed. Awesome. Well, this looks fabulous. And I can't wait to see the uh, amount of money and tourists that come pouring in. Look, look, they're just their little cars. There they go. Anyway, guys, this has been Cheese Puff in the City by Committee. And have a great day. Enjoy the... Uh, garbage problems. <laughs> Bye.